Hello everybody, welcome back to Mike's Microbe Peeps. This week, we're going to be peeping at diatoms. Diatoms are unicellular microscopic algae. They live in fresh water and salt water all around the world. Almost all of what you see in this video here are different species of diatoms. And you might notice that they sparkle and glow almost like jewels. No wonder diatoms are sometimes called jewels of the sea. Take a look at the cell wall of the big green diatom in this clip here. Don't these cell walls almost look like glass cases? That's because a cell wall of a diatom, which is called a frustule, it's actually made of silica, which is the same material that glass is made from. And you'll notice in this video that those glass cell walls often have intricate ribs and designs built into them, which gives the diatom such a sparkle when the light hits it. Something else you're going to notice in this video is that many of these diatoms are moving. You see other microorganisms move around using tiny hairs called cilia or flagella, or like amoeba, they may drag themselves around using a pseudopod or false foot. But diatoms don't have any of those. You see, diatoms have a slit in their cell wall called a raphe, and through that slit, they secrete mucus onto solid objects, and they actually glide along the surface of the solid object like a slip and slide. In fact, they actually leave a trail of mucus as they move along from one place to another, like a toddler with a really bad cold. In addition to being incredibly beautiful and having such an awesome method of mobility, diatoms are a very important part of life on the planet Earth. That's because, like plants, Diatoms have chloroplasts, and they do photosynthesis to convert sunlight and CO2 into chemical energy and oxygen. Think about that. About 70% of the Earth is water, and diatoms make up nearly half of all the biological material in the world's oceans. That means you have all of those billions and trillions of little diatoms all over the earth, converting CO2 into oxygen. That's why diatoms produce 20 to 50% of the oxygen we breathe. How do you like those apples, rainforests? Well, I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video. I hope you had a little fun and maybe learned something too. If you did, please give the video a like. And I'd love it if you'd subscribe to this channel for future content. See you next time on Microbe Peeps.